Warden Chris McCabe spots two sportsmen entering a popular hunting area. During hunting season, wardens are always on the lookout for potential violators. Oh, if there's blood there, I'm just gonna take a quick look at this. In Maine, hunters are only allowed one deer per season. That's fresh. Fresh blood could mean that one of the hunters may have killed a deer and are back out for a second time. And there's a uh, 12 gauge with, looks like buckshot. And it's actually, um, it says right on the label, it says deer. <laughs> the wardens decide to go undercover and catch up with the hunters on the trail. How's it going today? Good. We'll check your hunting licenses if you got those handy. Got a doe tag or? I, I'm all tagged out. Oh, you are? Yeah. Nice. I'm just bird hunting today. You can check, I got bird shot in my gun. OK. The man carries a shotgun, which can be used to hunt either birds or deer, though with different types of ammunition. McCabe asks him to unload his shotgun. When did you get your deer? This morning. Oh, no. Nice. Bird hunters use cartridges filled with pellets called bird shot. Deer hunters use solid bullets called slugs. That's a that's a slug. Yeah, it must put in there. Which that was the first one that came out. He quickly unloaded his gun really really fast. There was one 12 gauge slug. I th honestly thought I. All right, come over here. All right. It's, it's the first one that came out of your gun. I I swear to God. It's the f listen. We we deal with this all the time. It's the f I mean. I'm gonna tell you. I John will tell you. Yeah. Honestly. You got a slug. I don't have any more. Yeah. The man insists that he's only bird hunting, and the deer slug in his shotgun was a mistake. But McCabe isn't buying it. I don't care if you have any more. I didn't like, what I care about is that that's the first one that's coming out of the gun as soon as you ejected it. I, I, I promise you, I wasn't hunting deer. I was, I, I, I was, I promise you, I, that right there, is totally an accident, and I didn't. How do you accidentally put in a slug as your first because one? Because I have out? all red ones, and I. And this is a high brass. I, I honestly didn't notice. I swear. I swear. You know, I, I I'm a very spiritual man. I would never have done that. Yeah. John, would you would you vouch for me? Honestly, I, I, he, he's about as religious as a day is long, man. He, we had to go home so we could get bird shot, so he wouldn't be breaking the law. I mean. You know. So it just mysteriously appeared in the shotgun. Yes. Because you want to know something? What? That I know that maybe you don't know? What? That the three inch is back in the truck. I can guarantee you there's no three inch back in the truck. You can? Yeah. The man continues his story that he is hunting birds, but the wardens notice something else that suggests otherwise. So you got a grunt tube on you that you just happened yeah, to I leave forgot. on you? Yeah. Let me tell you something. I'm I I'm, left you, what I'm, I'm telling you, around my neck because I just forgot to take it off. A grunt tube is a calling device for deer, a useless tool on a bird hunt. I can't believe this has happened to me, John. Well, it's, it is really not adding up, OK? We'll go back to the vehicle. And... Yeah, it's just a buckshot. A consent search of the hunter's truck reveals that the box labeled deer McCabe saw earlier is empty. So they change tactics and focus on the deer grunt tube. When you took your deer home, how long did you stay home? We hung it up. Yeah. And I just threw everything on the table. That's why I want to take you guys over and show you the table. Did you go inside and do yeah. anything to eat or have something to eat? Or? We didn't eat at the house, no. But you guys sat at the table for a bit and put the stuff down and all that. The wardens are trying to determine whether his story of forgetting the grunt tube around his neck rings true. Let me get back with you here in a second. Is it possible that you got confused? Yeah. I need to pile all that clothes on and forget to put his, take his grunt call off. I know. That's, I, that's, that's, that's what I was getting at with how, how long were you home and everything. Most people, you go inside, you're not going to leave all your stuff on. That's what he's talking about. They went home and they piled all this stuff up. So why wouldn't you take the grunt tube off? You got warning cards. Let's just do that. Let's do the warnings and say, you know what? If I catch you out here again and you have a slug on you, you are getting a ticket. Warden McCabe will let the hunters off with a warning instead of a summons. 